To start recording, simply click the Screencastify icon in your browser toolbar. You can then choose to record your browser tab, your desktop, or your webcam. Once you've chosen your recording type, simply click record to start recording and your countdown will begin. You are now ready to record. Once you're finished, simply click end recording and that's it. After you finish recording, your video will automatically save to your Google Drive account and you will find your videos in my video page, which I'll show you next. To access your My Video page, click the Screencastify extension and you will click this pull down for more options. You will then go to My Videos and you will see a new tab open and then you will see all of the videos that you've created. Once you're ready to export your video, you can find those options on the watch page. You will see an export video pull down. From there, you will see options, download file from Drive, export as MP4, export as GIF, export as MP3, or get an embedded code. Once you've decided how you would like to export your video, simply click that option and your video will begin exporting. If you're looking to get to the editor from my videos page, simply click edit and you will launch the editor, which will open in a new tab. Once you've launched the editor, you're ready to start editing your video. Once you've entered the editor, you're ready to start editing. To trim your video, simply drag the trim handles on either end of the video to get your desired length. You can also click the cut button in the toolbar to cut your video into two clips wherever the cursor lies. To crop your video, click the crop button in the toolbar. You can then drag the crop handles to the selected area that you wish to keep. Once you're happy with your selected area, simply click done. To add text to your video, click the text button in your toolbar and type the text in the text box. Once you've added your text, you can update the font, font size, and color, as well as the placement of the text. Additionally, you can grab the text and elongate wherever the text is sitting within the video, as well as move it along the frames. You can also use the editor to zoom into areas of the video. You can also blur areas of the video if there's any sensitive information you do not want the viewer to see. You can adjust the volume of your audio by clicking on the bottom of the clip and using the slider. Once you finish editing your video, you can export it as an MP4 or to your Screencastify library in Google Drive. Once you've recorded and edited your video, you can share your video with just a few simple clicks. You can either copy your shared link or choose a desired channel to share. Before you can share, you'll want to make sure that your share settings are configured. You can do this by clicking show share settings and then click edit. From there, you can choose your video visibility settings. Once your settings are configured, you can share via the watch page link you can also share via Gmail, QR code, share via Google Classroom, or other share options.